course, you all have seen me solder, solder wires many, many times. And this really isn't going to be any different than the other times. I have a lighter somewhere. I'll melt the tubing on down here in just a second. Provided the wind. Let me just block it off here a little bit. This is not going to be as easy as I thought it would. There we go. Nice. Let's check it to see if it works. Beautiful, beautiful. Getting close to seven o'clock. It's five minutes till. I'm hoping I'm done in time for Hell's Kitchen anyway. This is the first time in a long time that I've actually been able to watch it and have time. In the past I've been in college, had stuff going on, and been able to watch it. I do not like those solderless connectors. I hate them actually. Most of the time when I get like the wire terminals, the ends, I will take them apart and solder them on. Corroded, muddy, and oops. Oh, okay, that pulled out of the connector. That's okay. That'll hold that in there until I get it put together anyway.
each terminal location is marked for quick assembly. Old style, they weren't. You had to follow a diagram. I remember my dad getting charts out and looking and matching wires up because these uh, turn these connectors weren't marked. This was wired once before, but I was having problems with the tail lights. If you can remember a few years back, I made a video where I was, where I was trying to trace down tail light troubles, and I ended up having to take and cut out the connector because it was corroded real bad. It had a quick inline tap on it, and it was in bad shape, so I just went ahead and took it out. Tighten that up some more. And we're done.